Ensure appropriate hand hygiene and infection control practices have been followed before seeing a new client. An ankle brachial index or AVI test compares the blood flow in the arms, close to the heart, to the feet, far from the heart. If possible, recline the person. Ask the person for verbal consent and explain the process will involve placing blood pressure cuffs onto the person and listening to their blood flow. This test will help to indicate a more accurate understanding of the quality of blood flow to the person's feet. Consider the following safety precautions. Do not attempt if the person has significantly reduced blood flow or low blood pressure. Do not place the pressure cuff over or near an open lesion. Do not continue a test if the person complains of pain or discomfort from the cuff. Position the blood pressure cuff on the ankle. Using your pointing and middle finger, find both pulses on the feet. Apply ultrasound gel and find pulse using the Doppler. While holding the Doppler in place, use the other hand to inflate the cuff until the sound of the pulse disappears. Take the pressure up another 20 millimeters. Watch the pressure dial and release the valve to slowly deflate the cuff. Record the pressure at which the pulse sound returns. This finding is the systolic pressure. Completely release the valve and all pressure from the cuff. Record the findings. Now, repeat for the inside ankle pulse. Ensure the cuff has completely deflated and remove it from the person's foot. Using gauze or a paper towel, wipe away any gel from the person's foot. Record the findings. Put the cuff on the person's arm on the same side as the foot you have tested. Add ultrasound gel to the area of the pulse you are first testing. Using one hand, Hold the Doppler probe in place to find and listen to the pulse. Use the other hand to inflate the cuff until the sound of the pulse disappears and take the pressure up another 20 millimeters. Release the valve to slowly deflate the cuff and record the pressure at which the pulse sound returns. Ensure you have completely released the valve and all pressure from the cuff. Record the findings. Repeat this process for the foot and arm on the other side. Calculate the ankle brachial index or ABI by dividing the highest systolic pressure reading on that foot by the highest systolic pressure reading of either arm. Use the table to interpret what the ABI you have found may indicate. Explain the findings to the person. Discuss and agree on any actions and appropriate follow-up.